The captivating world of my African cichlid aquariums offers a mesmerizing glimpse into a perfect clear aquarium, which also show the perfectly grown-up fishes. This you can see by comparing this video with my previous video, shared those previous video links in the description. Continue till end of the video to understand the common mistakes done by novice and experienced aquarists and its impact on the health and well-being of our aquatic pets. By understanding these pitfalls and adopting best practices, you can create a thriving underwater haven like mine, beginner blunders, diving into the deep end too soon. Point 1. Underestimating research, the excitement of setting up a new aquarium can be overwhelming, leading some beginners to skip crucial research. Understanding the specific needs of your chosen fish species, tank size requirements, water chemistry parameters, and filtration systems is paramount. Thorough research lays the foundation for a healthy and stable aquatic environment. Point 2. Impulse buying. The dazzling array of fish and aquarium equipment can be tempting, but impulse purchases often lead to trouble. Remember, fish have specific compatibility needs, and overcrowding a tank with incompatible species can lead to aggression, stress, and disease. Plan your tank layout and choose fish that will thrive together in the available space. Point 3. Ignoring the nitrogen cycle. The nitrogen cycle is the foundation of a healthy aquarium. It's the process by which beneficial bacteria break down fish waste into less harmful substances. New aquariums lack this essential bacterial population, and introducing fish too soon can lead to an ammonia spike, a toxic environment for aquatic life. Perform a fission cycle with a small number of hardy fish or consider fishless cycling methods to establish the nitrogen cycle before introducing your desired fish. Point 4. Neglecting water changes. Aquarium water accumulates ammonia, nitrites, and nitrates from fish waste and uneaten food. Regular water changes, typically 20 to 50 percent every week for a well-established tank, are essential to maintain water quality and prevent fish health problems. Point 5. Improper feeding. Overfeeding is a common beginner mistake. Fish don't need constant meals, and uneaten food decomposes, impacting water quality. Feed your fish only what they can consume in a few minutes, two to three times a day for most species. Research the specific dietary needs of your chosen fish and offer a varied diet of flakes, pellets, frozen, or live food. Point 6. Lack of maintenance. Aquarium maintenance goes beyond just water changes. Regularly clean the filter media, siphon the gravel to remove debris, and monitor water parameters frequently. Neglecting these tasks can lead to a buildup of harmful toxins and create an unhealthy environment for your fish. Now let's look at errors done by experienced aquarists. Lessons learned at times becomes as lessons missed. Point 1. Ignoring compatibility. Even experienced aquarists can overlook compatibility issues. Adding new fish without considering their temperament and size can disrupt the established hierarchy and lead to aggression. Research potential tank mates thoroughly and ensure they can coexist peacefully. Point 2. Neglecting upgrading equipment. As fish grow and tank populations change, existing equipment might become inadequate. Failing to upgrade filters, lighting, or heating systems as needed can lead to insufficient water flow, insufficient light for plant growth, or fluctuating water temperatures, all detrimental to fish health. Point 3. Overlooking early signs of disease. Experienced aquarists may become complacent, missing early signs of illness in their fish. Regularly observe your fish for changes in behavior, appetite, or physical appearance. Early detection and diagnosis can improve the chances of successful treatment. Point 4. Introducing untreated plants or new fish. Introducing new plants or fish without proper quarantine procedures can introduce parasites or diseases into your established tank. Quarantine new arrivals for several weeks in a separate tank to prevent the spread of illness to your existing fish population. Point 5. Ignoring technological advancements. The aquarium hobby is constantly evolving. New filtration systems, lighting options, and water testing kits are becoming available. Experienced aquarists might stick to tried and true methods, but staying informed about advancements can help optimize tank environments and improve fish well being. Point 6 The never ending learning curve, regardless of experience level, there's always more to learn in the world of aquariums. 
Engaging with online forums, joining aquarium clubs, or attending workshops can provide valuable insights and help troubleshoot issues with experienced hobbyists. Try with local groups and international group to get multiple solutions from different knowledge sources. For creating a thriving underwater world. Let's start understanding and avoiding these common mistakes, thereby both beginners and experienced aquarists can create a flourishing underwater environment for their fish. Remember, aquariums are living ecosystems requiring dedication and consistent care. The reward? A tranquil and captivating underwater world teeming with life, a source of beauty and wonder in your home. Here are some additional tips for a successful aquarium experience. Point 1. Choose the right aquarium size, plan for the future size of your chosen fish and avoid overcrowding. Point 2. Invest in quality equipment, reliable filtration, lighting, and heating systems are. By following all these main pointers and subscribing to my channel, you can be aware of more interesting concepts on aquarium and many more interesting niche at a single place. Do like, share and comment on the video.